Hi everyone, I hope you can hear me. I'm without my mic. Today I want to work on a few things for the cottages and in case you're new here, we built a few cottages that we plan to rent out and at this point they're actually finished and cleaned and ready to be furnished with pretty things. This is my favorite part and of course I like to use some things that I already have on hand that maybe just give it a fresh coat of paint, you know, make it all nice and then use it in the cottages. To me it's so much more fun doing that versus going and buying new things. So I thought today instead of going shopping like antique malls or thrift stores or going on to you know, Facebook Marketplace, I'm going to venture into my own little shop and see if I can find something in there I can use. I'll take you with me, although I'm kind of embarrassed how it looks, but I have a few items in mind that I think I'll be able to use. They may need a bit of fine tuning, but let's see what we have. So as you can see back here is where my stash is. These are just items that I eventually want to get to and repurpose. Uh, I know some of them look a bit hopeless, but I also have lots of old doors and windows back here. Those sometimes come in handy depending on what kind of project I have going on. What I'm looking for today is possibly an entryway bench and maybe a shelf with hooks. And I do know I have a bench back here. Um, it's right here. I know it's kind of hard to see, but it actually has a back, but I think I take the back off and paint it. And I can't have anything too large in the entryway. There's not a lot of room. And I do know I have a shelf over here on the other side that I think I could pair up with that bench. Um, it's this white one here. This is one that I had made years ago. I actually made it for my sister Marlene, and she no longer had use for it, so here it is. So let's dig out those pieces and see what we can do with them. I'll start out by removing the back, and I'm probably lucky if I can get all of these rusted bolts out. This bench had been on the outside. I had it down on the pavilion by the pond for a couple years, so things are fairly rusted. Here I'm using up some various white paints that I have on hand. Some are satin sheen and others are flat.
I'm really impressed with the color this seat turned out to be. Uh, here I'm applying Annie Sloan Clear Wax uh, just to give it a nice, hard, smooth surface. So I wanted to do something a bit different with this shelf and what I have in mind is to add some botanical prints on the back, like behind the shelf part. I think that would be really fitting to old orchard cottages. So I bought some from an Etsy shop called Design Outfitters. I'm really impressed with the quality of them. Printed those out. And now I'm arranging them on the back here. I'll probably put pieces of wood in between each print to kind of separate them. And I plan to just hot glue these down. That way, in case I ever want to remove them, I can. I'm almost debating leaving the color of the little wood pieces as they are versus painting them green. I wonder what you guys think, but I kind of like the look of it. like these black hooks kind of stood out too much with all the other colors on the shelf. So I'm going to paint it white, see how that looks. found this cute little pillow at Lowe's. I thought it's just the perfect color to go with this entryway bench and shelf. Hope you guys enjoyed this video gotta say I'm really impressed with how this turned out it's nothing fancy by any means but I think it will function well here in the entryway I like how everything looks against the shiplap wall we plan to probably hang a little chalkboard on one of these hooks uh, welcoming our guests into this cottage uh, maybe just a little welcome sign with their names on it so that's still happening but otherwise I think this entryway is pretty much finished I'll take you guys over to the other cottage and show you the entryway there I had actually done that one too I had taken a short video just using my phone so it might be in the portrait mode but I'll show you how we created a hook board and then we just ended up using a bench that we had at home in the shop 
for that entryway and I found the cutest little pillow for that bench too. So I'll take you over there and show you that. Thanks guys for watching this video. I appreciate it. I hope your day is going great and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.